Hello and welcome to brand new airport preview time once again. You may remember not too long ago we did Chateau Airfield which is just over on the right and part of the Tongariro National Park. Well this just ahead of us here is National Park. No not THE National Park, the town itself is called National Park not exactly very inventive was it not sure what other options they had for a town name hey let's call our town collection of houses and some roads yeah uh, but at least you do get to fly past the house on the right there where Brian lives uh, last night him and his wife were having a laugh with each other they just how competitive they are but he laughed harder than she did. Try and get some altitude fairly quickly because there are some power lines ahead to worry about. Although I have noticed if you do use the full sim heaven overlay, sometimes power lines don't exist or they're in slightly different places. So if you use the full sim heaven package, they might not be there for you, but they certainly are for me. But we've cleared them anyway. So yeah, not uh, too far away from here, there's only a couple of minutes flight over on the right, is uh, Chateau Airfield, which is very nice. There's the brand new one which we've just done a touch and go at, which is XNZNP National Park Airfield. And that's very nice. And then just coming up on the wingtip right now is one that's roughly halfway between the two of them. And it's a bit rubbish really. Uh, there's nothing there. I've, I've put a hanger down at the end just to make it slightly interesting if you did want to land there. But it... The whole airfield tips over sideways, it's a bit dull and boring. It's, um, seriously, if you're in this area, land at Chateau or land at National Park instead, they're much better. And the, that other thing, I've not even bothered to give it a name, so it won't show up on the map. But it's there if you do want to land at it. Uh, but seriously, don't. What you might want to have a look at, though, is this thing below us now, which is the spiral. You can see it's all about changing the elevation of the railway which comes in and loops back on itself and then spirals underground so it can loop underneath itself probably can't see on the video very well but I've made some tunnels for where it disappears underground so it, it all looks a lot better than the default version now although I still haven't entirely made up my mind about that with the whole thing of the loops and the underground bit so it can cross over itself all of that to change the elevation I'm still a little undecided on whether that is a brilliant bit of engineering or really terrible forward planning yeah I don't know um, but anyway let's head back to National Park Airfield we appear to be coming in way too fast and a little bit high as well. Let's try a side slip and get rid of some altitude. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God, that's terrible. If my old flying instructor Morris could see me now, he would probably punch me in the face. And after that touchdown, I'd probably let him. Yeah, I'm not sure I really want to see this again, but... Well, at least you know they are one-shot videos now. I don't keep re-recording these until I get a good one. Jesus Christ. So, welcome to XNZNP National Park Airfield. Which, if you can make a decent landing here, it's actually quite nice. Especially if you come in the other way, like the first touch and go, coming in over the town. Being able to see that on your approach, that's actually quite nice. So, yeah, I rather like this place. Uh, we'll just 
should park up here, and that will probably do. Well, as usual, if you want a copy, I'll upload this one on explain.org and also put it in my mega folder. But also do check the mega folder for XNZCH Chateau Airfield, where there's an upgrade to that. I'll do a little video for it just to show you what it is. The airfield hasn't changed, it's just some of the surrounding areas and there's some custom buildings and made that all look a lot better. So I think it's worth getting, but have a look at the video and you can decide for yourself. As for this one though, that was National Park and uh, yeah, hopefully you'll enjoy flights here. So until next time, see you soon. Bye.